in the darkness She waits silently Her venomous heart craving sweet victor With a touch so deadly She'll bring you to your knees She's the Black Widow, the Queen of Deceit Welcome to the Black Widow channel Where desire and danger intertwine She'll spin her web, she'll trap you in a spell With a smile so wicked, she's one of a kind Hey guys, I was cooking last night and there's a little something I like to do when I make steaks on the grill and I thought I'd just share it with you and see if you ever wanted to try it. These are three jalapenos seeded and quartered and I like to fry them, saute them, simmer them, whatever you want to call it, but I'll show you how I do it. It's really good, but I could eat jalapenos all day long anyway. I, I could eat them morning, noon, and night. Any, any time. I just take a little bit of butter, real butter, that's all I use is real butter. And I put it in a frying pan. Just I, I don't measure anything, so I just put a little bit of butter in the frying pan. And turn it on medium, maybe. Okay, then I take the butter and I melt it real good, and then I turn it up a little bit. And I let it get brown. Not burnt, just brown. So if you know what brown butter is, then you know what I'm talking about. Because I like that that nutty brown flavor it has to it when it gets this color. Then I like to just add a little bit of sesame seed oil. Toasted sesame seed oil. Um, you know, some. I don't know. Turn it over. Drizzle it in there for a minute and take it out. And then I crank the heat up a little bit. Because then I like to get it hot. Then I like to put my jalapenos in the hot butter and oil. And I like it hot because I like my jalapeno skins and the outside of the of the peppers to like blister. You know, almost like you broil them in the oven, how they blister. Then I just like to oil, uh, put in a little garlic powder. And when they start to get a little tender, I'll put the everything bagel seasoning on top. Because that doesn't need to do anything hardly but just get hot. And that's pretty much it. That's all there is to it. It doesn't take but a couple minutes. And then they just really taste good on your steak. I could eat them in a bowl by themselves, though. Thanks for coming.